Well, it's hard to imagine any celebration with family without good food. And this weekend in Grand Rapids, you can take a foodie tour around the world without ever leaving DeVos Place. The International Wine, Beer and Food Festival rolls into town beginning today. Kaylin and Stephanie are live there this morning. Good morning, Kaylin. Hey, good morning, you guys. Live this morning in Grand Rapids at the International Wine, Beer and Food Festival. And it's so much more than just wine and beer we're learning. Specialty spirits, a cider, a spirit, Paul? No, cider is technically a wine, actually. It is. It is. So you fall into the wine category of the festival. And you guys, you're with Vandermill Ciders. You guys are located in Spring, remind, Lake. Spring Lake, right out here on the west side of the state. It, it, just cider? Is that you guys are 100% cider? We have our brewing license also, but we are pr primarily focused on just cider. Okay. So we have a tasting room and, and a restaurant at our place, awesome. uh, and you can find our products throughout Michigan and Illinois. So. I'm excited to learn about them. Let's start mm. with this one. A lot of people were talking about this when you brought this in this morning. What is this? Uh, we call that Totally Roasted. We actually did that uh, a number of years ago, originally as a collaborative with a local restaurant, just uh, coming up with new ideas. So we take cinnamon roasted pecans uh, and then we soak them in the cider for about four days uh, so you get kind of a little bit of nutty you get um, some cinnamon some it vanilla cinnamony for sure yeah it smells good and what what we hear a lot about our ciders is that uh, you know people like them a because we're using 100 percent juice we use uh, we press our own fruit right here from west michigan awesome uh, and our ciders don't tend to be as sweet as what okay. some of the bigger brands are so and we they hear can that be a little sugary at the top of the bigger brands and then right. the second one you brought this one smells i can smell the ginger from here it smells delicious yep this is a ginger peach um, and it kind of is what it is we take you know what it says we uh, we take our base apple. We do a kind of a traditional hard cider also, mm -hmm. and we'll use that product a lot of times as a as a base starting point for some of these other other products. One thing people are loving about ciders is that they're gluten free, which is another thing we want to mention to people because a lot of people with celiac disease go to cider as a drink. What? Why did you guys want to be a part of the festival this weekend? There are going to be seventeen thousand people coming here. Yeah, last year I think was the first year. Um, that we were, well, certainly the first year we were involved, okay. and cider has, you know, become more and more popular. We've been doing it since 2008, okay. um, but I think, you know, especially in the last couple of years, it's gotten a lot more popular, so it's, it's starting to catch the attention of the show, and people really want to see it here. People so. are seeking out the cider, and it is delicious. You guys, all the information for getting your tickets to the International Wine, Beer, and Food Festival is on our website. Have a wonderful little day, and I'll see you guys in about a half hour. <laughs> Yeah, a lot of cool recipes we've seen throughout the morning. 17,000 people. Yeah, it's going to be uh, an incredible mm -hmm. event. So uh, much more from Grand Rapids. Stay with us.